Hey folks, Captain Steve here, out with Captain Tyler Wolcott. We've been fishing a lot, we've been fishing headwaters a lot. Bite's really turning on. Tyler, what have you been doing? I've uh, been doing a little bit of artificial, a little bit of shiner trips. Um, honestly, artificial has been fun. Just covering water, catching a bunch of fish. Then fish are starting to move around a bunch, starting to feed on bait, starting to get out in the deep holes. Um, so that's pretty cool, getting to live scope some out there. So it's a fun time of year to fish. Yeah. Know? Hey, are you noticing that a lot of the fish are starting to bunch back up in the deeper water now? Or? Yep. Um, so there's a few different places that in the past I've caught some out in the deeper water, say the pits or just anywhere that there's like 10 or more foot of water. Um, those fish will get out there and chase bait. And they haven't been out there for the last few weeks, but I checked one last week and they were loaded up. So they're definitely getting out there pretty heavily. So y'all been catching them pretty good. Yeah. Pretty steady. Yep. Some big ones, some fat ones. Definitely you can see big giant schools of bait bigger than my boat out there. And, yeah, because uh, you have the live scope and everything to be able to show folks the fish. Yep. I mean, actually, sometimes even before you catch them. Yep, that's right. That's pretty damn cool stuff right there, buddy. Uh, you know, we've been fishing a lot of artificial and shiners. Uh, you know, the uh, the artificial bite that I've seen, you know, come on, especially here as of late, is that uh, hollow body frog. Yep. Um, on the east side, we've been throwing that a lot, and they've been, I mean, just blasting that frog. Uh, and I know some other folks are throwing, you know, um, some topwater plugs, you know, some walking baits, things to that effect. But the shiner bite's been phenomenal. I mean, it's really turning on for us as well. Uh, we've been finding them in the deeper holes, um, you know, next to weed lines and so on. Yep. So, you know, is that about what, you know, about where you're at on that right now is that yeah i think there's definitely a lot of fish chasing bait and so they'll get along those deeper grass lines and in those deeper holes um but yeah i mean they're starting to eat bluegill too that's why that popping frog bites pretty good because they're looking at some of them bluegills You'll, i've seen some big ones throwing bluegills out of water so wow it's wow. getting to be that time of year so that uh, swim jig bite ought to be going fairly decent as well then yep so somebody told me they had a good day at Kenyonsville the other day oh uh -huh. I saw some photos of a buddy of mine, and they were jacking eights and nines over there, but they were shiner fishing. Mm. The shiner bite is on. It, it really is on. Hey, if you're looking for a guided fishing trip, Captain Steve, FL Big Bass Adventures. TylerWolcottFishing.com. There you go. Yep. Come get in the boat with us. Let's go catch some. See ya.